Hey guys, Stuart. Um, so today I went and bought the 3M Paint Defender and uh, reason being I want to protect the front bumper of my car. I uh, just had it painted since I got in the wreck and uh, living out here in Vegas it's, you know, it's pretty dusty. There's rocks, there's little things, pebbles everywhere on the road so that can damage clear coat, base coat, things of that nature. So anything to prevent any further damage to a brand new painted bumper, hopefully this does the trick. So um, I've already prepped the bumper, as you can see, it's right behind me. Let me step out the camera. Um, I've removed the, uh, the fog surrounds, the fog lights, the grill, um, and all the little accoutrements that go with it. Uh, today, uh, I already, like I said, I already prepped the bumper, so it's ready to rock and roll. Um, I used uh, the Meguiar's Ultimate Compound, and it's, uh, it's pretty good. Uh, it's cheap, works really well. The bumper, I mean, after I've done it, you can see the shine off of it right now. It's, it's pretty impressive. And then um, for polish, I used the uh, supplied polish that came in the kit, which is 3M Synthetic Blend Wax. And um, it's quite good. Uh, it's good gloss finish to it. And um, there's plenty to go around, which is great. Because if you weren't just doing your bumper, if you decided to do, like, say, the top part of your hood, maybe... Uh, uh, fenders, anything of that nature, rear bumper, things like that. There's plenty in this, and polish goes a long way. You don't have to use a ton of it, which is, you know, um, for all the car detailing guys that know the how-tos and how-don'ts. And, um, yeah, so on to the good stuff. Uh, the paint fender itself. Um, I've read up uh, great reviews on it. Um, it's pretty, pretty simple. It's just like Plasti Dip, you know. Um, a little more tacky, though. You have to go a little bit slower so it's heavier coming down and you have to do about three coats left to right up and down then left to right again um, but other than that uh, it should turn out pretty good um, I already have a, a trigger which makes life ten times easier if you're using any type of aerosol can um, just due to the fact that after a while a little pointer finger gets a little tired and also you don't sometimes people you'll get blisters and things like that and it helps prevent that so uh, yeah, um, should be interesting. I'm kind of excited to see the outcome of it and uh, hopefully it turns out pretty good. So uh, I will let you guys know shortly um, or probably a couple hours or so after it's cured because it you need to have to, you have to put the bumper outside and let the sun hit it for about two hours to set and then it gets that really gloss finish. Um, but um, yeah, I'll take pictures and stuff along the way and uh, it should be pretty interesting to see the outcome. So hopefully it works and it protects the front bumper.